Hello everyone, welcome to the first part of the Persona 5 hard playthrough. So, I know it's been a while since I uploaded an Oxenfree playthrough part, and that's sort of going to be on hold for a little bit until I've finished classes for this semester. But as I've sort of come to the end of semester, I felt like playing a bit of Persona forever. And so I'm going to do a little bit of playthrough. Episodes will be roughly 30 minutes to an hour long. And I'll sort of change that depending on how much I want to get through in a certain episode. So this will be the commentary sort of playthrough, but what I'll also be uploading is a non-commentary playthrough. So if you just want to watch the game without me talking over it, <laughs> there will also be a playthrough for you as well. Alright, so with that, let's get started. So just as a note, I have played this before, but I will try and be spoiler free as much as I can with it. So let's get going. This story is a work of fiction. Similarities between characters or events to persons living or dead in your world are purely coincidental. Only those who have agreed to the above have the privilege of partaking in this game. The contract has been sealed. The world is not as it should be. It's filled with distortion, and ruin can no longer be avoided. Those who oppose fate and desire change. From time to time, they were referred to as tricksters. You are the trickster. Now is the time to rise against the abyss of distortion. Now get running. All right. Let's get chance. going. Stay calm. You can get away now. We'll retrieve the briefcase on our end. Oh, yes, the mysterious transmission. What's that? Don't worry about us. <laughs> Just concentrate on getting away. All right. So we're playing as this mysterious person who's trying to escape what looks like a casino. Nice work as always, Joker. All right. It's the agents. You better escape them. Use the gun. And no more noise. Easy. Easy victory. But then again, that's what you would expect in the tutorial. <laughs> Uh. 
Now it's dodged. I was tempted to go back and actually fight them. Okay. Dude, can he even hear us? Don't worry, I'm picking up everyone's voices. Just go, Joker. Alright, so this way, I believe. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Can't believe it went the wrong way. Okay. Oh no. They're catching on to us. Oh. You'll never get away if you just keep fighting. Hide in the shadows and sneak past when you see an opening. So now we just simply sneak up on him. Hey, are you sure that he came in this way? Understood. I'll continue the search. And then he just runs right past us. Now's your chance. Run for the stairs. Right. These agents aren't very good at what they do. to find some kid you have your teammate to thank for this you were sold out <coughs> suspect confirmed cuff it rip joker Not a good sign. Guess drug. the drug was too strong. Wake him up. <sighs> not a good sign. They should not be doing this. No dozing off. You still don't get it, do you? Give it up! Oh, jeez. Cooperate. What? You want another shot? Yeah, no. You shouldn't have even given him the first shot, you what, idiot. What about the camera? Are you thinking it can be used as video evidence? So, just as a note, um, all of these options at the beginning mean nothing, so I'm just going to be an absolute smartass with them. <laughs> hear my question? Answer. Ooh! Jeez. Now I'll be choosing these joke answers mainly because I haven't seen them before myself. Possession of weapons. Manslaughter too, yeah? Talk about the works. 
thing that all those crimes were led by a punk like this. And you seem to be enjoying every second of it. Huh? I was enjoying it. Everything's hazy. I can't remember. Okay. So as I said at the start, this is going to be a hard playthrough. Mainly because I've played through normal myself, casually. You should know your place. Sign here. It's a confession under your name. Again, the joke option. <laughs> see. I need your hand to sign this, but Oh I don't Jeez. Care if you end up losing a leg. Oh my god. I had no idea they'd actually do that. So we're just forced to sign. walk out of here in one piece. Uh. I'm going to make you understand. One must take full responsibility for their actions. Our name. So our name is going to be Kath Ram. Easy. Kath Ram. That is my name. I'm finished. Hmm, I wonder who this person is. Excuse me, but this area is off. I'm Nijima from the public prosecutor's office. Woman in a business suit. I've got to give credit to this game. They do have... They do give their NPCs very descriptive names. I know she's obviously a main character, an important character, but even just the random. The prosecutor's office? What business do you have here? Just let me through. It's urgent. There's something I need to confirm with the suspect. Hmm. I wonder what that could be. I believe this case is no longer in your jurisdiction. Besides... You prosecutor sign Ijima. There's a call from your director. Hurry and get it over with. To be frank, you're being an inconvenience. Jeez, she's an inconvenience because she wants to interrogate a suspect. I'm responsible for this case, yet I'm not even being allowed an interrogation. I mean, that's a good point. If she's responsible for the case, she should be interrogated. I'm calling Sussman. because I knew you'd bring it up. I will not be convinced unless I confirm it for myself. This is my case. Uh, good luck to you then. I won't be expecting much, though. Uh, prosecutor, I forgot to mention something important. Oh, no. Your time will be cut short. We can't permit you to talk with him for long. What, worried we tell her about what you did to us? Jeez. It's for your own sake. Oh, boo. His methods are unknown. After all, we don't even know if it's safe to simply meet and speak with him. I mean, to be honest, I, I doubt it. Ah. I didn't expect it'd be you. Wait, so she already knows us. Interesting. You'll be answering my questions this time. <sighs> Those bastards. Yep. Can you hear me? It seems you've been through a lot. Almost anything can happen here, and I can't stop them. That's a tad war. That's why I need you to answer me honestly. I don't have much time either. What was your objective? Why did you cause such a major incident? I didn't think it was a prank from the get-go, but I couldn't assemble a case for prosecution. It's because I couldn't figure out the method behind it. Hmm. A 
Of course you couldn't. <laughs> oh, damn it! I was hoping for a bit There's of a no snarky response. Of such a world just by reading the reports. It what? seems you're coherent. When and where did you find out about that world? How is it even possible to steal another's heart? Now, tell me your account of everything. Stealing hearts? What is this, Kingdom Hearts? Start from the <laughs> very beginning. I like to save my current progress. Yes. And for people who don't want slight spoilers, <laughs> um, close your eyes. <laughs> so, <laughs> I actually played through one already, but I forgot to record. Reflective of real life today, unfortunately. Damn brat! I'll sue. Often the good Samaritan is the one punished. What? Ah. A real, a mental shutdown? It's the truth. To a person, though, <laughs> that's got to be a joke. You really love all that occult stuff, don't you? <laughs> If you are ever confused about what to do or where to go next, look to the upper right corner of the screen to view various hints. Head to your new lodging. Just <laughs> Exit the subway station. 
I nearly misread that as escape the subway station. <laughs> yes, as I was saying before, I accidentally did not record my first pass for this playthrough. And so I'm replaying it now, actually recording it this time. <laughs> Starting today, Sojiro Sakura will be taking care of me. His house should be in the back streets of this residential area. Uh, talking to people. All sorts of people live in the city. Try listening to their conversations or press the X button to talk to them. You might learn something new. Alright, so there's the policeman up there. We'll ask him for some directions. The unfriendly officer. Yes. I want to ask for directions. Hmm, you want to get to the residence at that address. It's in an alley a bit further back. Take a ride after that apartment with the stairs. Alright, so th this one just here, I think. Yep. Well, let's listen in. Was there another, um, accident? I see a policeman over there. Oh, he's just watching to make sure everyone's safe. It'd be scary if something like that happened again, though. Let's hurry home. Alright, so I think it's just down here. Yep. Sojiro Sakura's house. The nameplate here says Sakura. It looks like this might be Sojiro Sakura's house. Even after ringing the doorbell, it doesn't look like anyone will answer the door. Maybe he's gone out. Hmm, looks like no one's home. Oh yeah. Sakura's son's usually at his cafe around this time. Well, LeBlanc's in the back alley, so I should make my other deliveries first. Hmm. Next I need to take this package to... Oh, I really wanted to know who he took it, who he was going to take it to. Which way would be the fastest way to LeBlanc? The alley is too narrow. Alright, I'll just have to find it myself. Um... Let's see if the policeman knows. You again? What is it? Where is LeBlanc? LeBlanc? Oh right, that cafe. It's in, al it's in an alley past the tobacco shop here. Okay. So the tobacco shop, and then now... Yeah, here it is. It looks like this place is LeBlanc. I'll go inside. He's completely uninterested in it. <laughs> oh, right. Oh no. He doesn't seem happy to say, say that was today. Oh no. We'll be going now. The payment's on the table. Thanks for coming. Uh, this place is in the back alley, so there's no worries of a car crashing in here. <laughs> a what now? <laughs> he wasn't paying attention. Accidents, you know. I just hope that none happen around here. None of my concern. <laughs> Still disinterested. <laughs> well, see you next time. Oh, four hours for just a single cup of Joe. Jeez. So, you're the guy. Yes, yes, I am the guy. Okay, I'm gonna be smart ass. Is Sakura's son here? <laughs> yeah. I'm Sojiro Sakura. You'll be in my custody over the next year. Mm. I was wondering what kind of unruly kid would show up. Unruly? Jeez. Huh? Never. Have you been told? A customer of mine and your parents know each other and... Yes, that's so informative. That that Follow me. 
Ooh, we get to see our room. <laughs> what a this great room. Is room. At least give you sheets for your bed. Oh yes, great. We get to have sheets for the bed. Hmm? You look like you want to say something. Nothing. It's big. <laughs> it's on you to clean up the rest. Fair enough. I'll be leaving after I lock up each day. You'll be alone at night, but don't do anything stupid. I'll throw you out if you cause any trouble. Jeez, a bit harsh, though, Jerome. Now then. I got the gist of your situation. You protected some woman from a man forcing himself on her. He got injured, then sued you, right? Ah, oh, jeez. That's what you get for sticking your nose in a matter between two adults. Oh, my. You did injure him, yeah? Jeez, so Jerome. And now that you've got a criminal record, you were expelled from your high school. Okay, that still is a bit extreme in my opinion. The courts ordered you to transfer and move out here, which your parents also approved. Again, still seems really extreme for one incident. In other words, they got rid of you for being a pain in the ass. <laughs> Jeez. Way to be no uh, way to let us off not uh, never mind. <laughs> Way to be nice to us, Sojuro. It's best you not talk about anything unnecessary. I am in the restaurant business, you know. I mean, fair enough. Any bad talk about you a restaurant can be year. bad for it. If nothing happens, your probation will be lifted. A whole year? <laughs> That's perfect timing. <laughs> problems, and you'll be sent straight to juvie. Jeez. I mean, fair you enough if I'm probation. Tomorrow. Going where? <laughs> Shujin Academy, the school you'll be attending. We'll introduce ourselves properly to the staff there. There's rarely a place to accept someone like you, you know? I mean, that's still harsh. What a waste of my Sunday. My... Your luggage arrived earlier. <sighs> I left them over there. All right, now we get to explore our new room. I'll be living here starting today. I should check out what's in here. It's the cardboard box sent from back home. It's full of clothes and daily necessities. I'll change into something more comfortable for now. I think I butchered reading that. There are all these unused household items lying here. It's not organized at all. shelf with old books. Some parts of these shelves have rust on them. All these difficult looking books were carelessly crammed into it. I should start cleaning first. I'll start cleaning. I mean, he's not given us a nice room to start off with. It's just an attic. And all of our luggage, our whole life, put into a small box. That's actually a pretty big improvement, I'm not going to lie. It's late. It seems like I've been cleaning for a while. Hey, it's Sergio. Seriously? What the heck? I heard you making all sorts of noise up here, but I didn't think you were cleaning. Yeah, we did a good job, didn't we? Actually, the place doesn't look too bad. Though it's only natural you'd want to keep your room tidy. <laughs> Again, Sojuro, we just essentially cleaned up part of your restaurant for you. Why don't you go to bed for tonight? You don't have anything better to be doing, right? I'm gonna close up shop and get out of here myself. I'm gonna head back then. I won't be the I won't be the one looking after you if you get sick from staying up too late. You got that? Oh how nice, he does care. <laughs> Sleeping in your bed will move you forward one day. Going to bed is a special action that would that will advance time. Time is limited. Think carefully about your schedule before you act. Why is it definitely limited in this game? Another character will be stopping us from doing things. 
I should call it a day and just go to sleep. Starting today, this is my room. Change and go to sleep. So in the end, we'll probably play one more day. Um, arrest, trial, criminal record. Still, I couldn't just let that go. <sighs> that day, I had to go home early. Ooh, we're in our hometown. How about I just not live this nightmare? I can change the future? Ah, oh, dang it. My house isn't this way. I should hurry home. I think they're just up ahead. How dare you? Stop it! Let me go! Oh no. Okay, no. this is not a good situation. Don't give me that shit. It looks like that drunk man is bothering that woman. Help! Please stop! She's in danger. I can't ignore this. It's really unacceptable for him to be doing this. What a waste of time. You think you're worth causing me trouble? Huh? Uh, an arrogant to go with. Uh, I'll call the police. Call them if you want. The police are my bitches. No. Oh, They're not gonna take you seriously. Am I surprised no. that someone like him? Stop. Someone called them anyway. Someone Called the cops, huh? Get in the car. Incompetent fools like you just need to shut your mouths and follow where I steer this country. Jeez. What are you looking at? Get out of my face. I mean, I'm tempted to. Show. But Get lost, kid. I'm not gonna let this happen. See? This is all because you're so damn slow. <sighs> Get in the car. A horrible person. <laughs> this is why you put your phone on Do Not Disturb at night. Hmm. It's that weird app that somehow ended up on my phone. The icon looks almost like an eye. It's so creepy. My eyelids are starting to get heavy. Trickster, welcome to my velvet room. Not gonna lie, I forgot how creepy that scene was the first time. Too, inmate. The you in reality is currently fast asleep. You are only experiencing this as a dream. You're in the presence of our master. Stand up straight. Welcome. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. 
This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. It is a room that only those who are bound by a contract may enter. I am Igor, the master of this place. Remember it well. I summoned you to speak of important matters. It involves your life as well. <laughs> Let me out of here. No, no your place, Who do you Jeez. To? Still, do you regret that surprise. option. The state of this room reflects the state of your own heart. To think a prison would appear as such. You truly are a prisoner of fate. In the near future, there is no mistake that ruin awaits you. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Worry <laughs> Keep fighting it. There is a means to oppose such a fate. You must be rehabilitated, rehabilitated toward freedom. That is your only means to avoid ruin. Do you have the resolve to challenge the distortion of the world? Wait, what? You didn't decline. Hmm. Very well. <laughs> what? Allow me to I think I'll hug you that, Igor. Not declining doesn't mean the same as agreeing. Uh, pardon me for not introducing the others. To your right is Caroline. To your left, Justine. They serve as wardens here. Ha! Try and struggle as hard as you like. The duty of wardens is to protect inmates. We are also your collaborators. That is, if you remain obedient. I shall explain the roles of these two at another occasion. Now then, it seems the night is waning. It is almost time. Take your time to slowly come to understand this place. We will surely meet again, eventually. Time's up! Oh. Now hurry up and go back to sleep. Keep trying to escape. Alright. It's now the 10th of April. It's, I had a strange dream. Ruin? Rehabilitation? What does it mean? Hey. Looks like you're up. Well then, let's go introduce ourselves properly to the staff about your transfer. The school you're attending is in the... Sorry, I'm going to butcher these names. Is in the Aoyama district. It'll cost you a bit to ride the train there. And the route transfers are a pain. I'll drive you there, but just for today. Let's go. Jeez. Sheesh. Men aren't usually allowed in my passenger seat. That line is always so funny when taken out of context. Hey, it's our new school. Do me a favor and behave yourself, all right? What? And we don't behave ourselves, Sojourner? I don't care what happens to you. <laughs> what? So nice of you, Sojourner. Just so don't care. Cause me any trouble. <laughs> to reiterate, just so we're clear, you will immediately oh, be good old cause any problems. Honestly, I hesitated on accepting someone like you, but there were some circumstances on our side. He's hoping we find out what those circumstances are. You might have done a variety of things in hiding in your hometown. But you will behave yourself here. I mean, why does everyone think we're up to no good? Just because we have a criminal record, it doesn't mean that we're just gonna constantly be breaking the law and doing bad things. If you are <sighs> thrown out from our school, there will be no place for you to go. Keep that in mind. This is the teacher in charge of your class. I'm Sadayo Kawakami. Sadayo Kawakami, okay, Where's good. your student ID? Can at least get one name right. Hopefully. <laughs> Be sure to read the school rules. Any violations will send you straight to the guidance office. And if by chance you cause any problems, I won't be able to protect you at all. 
that is your promise, yes, Principal Kobayakawa? Mm-hmm. He is responsible for all his actions. But really, though, why me? There should have been better candidates. It was a sudden transfer, and your class was the only one that had an opening. If you're done explaining things, mind if we get going? <laughs> I guess we're to get out of it. <laughs> Sakura-san, please keep a close eye on him. Oh yes, I'm sure he'll really be doing that. Don't let him cause any trouble outside. Well, I'll be sure to have a serious talk about the situation he's in. Yeah, he's not going to care enough to keep an eye on us. <sighs> Come to the faculty office when you arrive at school tomorrow. I'll show you to your classroom. treating you like some kind of nuisance. I guess that's what it means to have a criminal record. Turns out your past follows you whenever you are wherever you go. By the way, if you get expelled now, I won't hesitate to kick you out. Got it? <laughs> I think I'll scrape by. <laughs> I could save us all a little time and just kick you out now if that's going to be your attitude. A tad harsh, but fair enough. Ah, school never changes, huh? Hey. Come on, we're going home. What a pleasant school. What a oh. troublesome situation. Ah, oh, the good old jersey wearing teacher. I can't believe they pushed someone with a record on me. A male teacher would be better suited for this. Why in the world was someone like that admitted here? Who knows? It was the principal's decision. I was told that it's for the school's reputation. I mean, how can... I suppose turning him around would be good for the school's reputation. I would have thought that my volleyball team has contributed more than enough to cover that. Arrogance. Great to hear from a teacher. That's certainly true. Be careful, okay? Then again, if anything were to happen, I'd kick out a student like that right away. Well, it's a good thing you're not our teacher, then. I keep wishing that he'd just end up not coming to school. Okay, that is really irresponsible as a teacher. Well, that isn't something I should be saying there as it a is. teacher. Well, I should be returning to practice. Oh, right. The tournament's coming up, isn't it? <laughs> Having such high expectations placed on you by others is quite a problem in itself. We'll have to work hard to make up for the track team, too. Oh yes, you'll have to make up for the track team. You'll have to be the one to make up for it. Not a spoiler, didn't say it. Didn't say why. <laughs> track is moving oh. He is talking. You're taking the train starting tomorrow. <laughs> Fair enough. That's why I take the train. So, how was it? The school, I mean. Think you can manage? Hmm. Eh, yeah, we'll see. Mm. <laughs> He's so unimpressed with us. <laughs> now listen up. Don't even think of doing anything stupid. Still, you were expelled once already. <laughs> to think you'd re-enroll in a different one. It's not like anyone will be sympathetic with you. Sad, but true. That's what it was like at school. People might say stuff about me in the future, too. What a troublesome kid I'm taking in. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> just no response. <laughs> I was asked to do it, and I just happened to agree to it. Yeah, I didn't ask so, Joe, but I imagine you got I'm money. Yeah, for it too. of course you did. A subway has derailed at Shibuya Station, greatly affecting the timetable all across the... Oh, another accident. So that's why it's so crowded. There's been a lot of those lately. The inbound train will soon be arriving at platform number one. Please wait behind the double
رو نگو بیدو direct footage from the accident. According to the police, the engineer's life was not in danger despite his injuries. After questioning, even he could not explain his high speed when approaching the station. No further comments were made. Police are still looking for a plausible motive. It's less of an operating accident and more of a crime of the company and the government. Site inspectors apparently reported all of this six months ago. The deterioration of the tracks and the ATC. Seems a railway company and the Ministry of Transport both turned a blind eye to the truth. There's no way they can hide. This will go all the way to the top. Now on to our main story. With this derailment accident, as well as other recent incidents of unknown motive, concern is spreading among the general public. Just what could be causing such a drastic change so suddenly in these people? SNN has Everything's linked. That's what you're thinking, correct? Hmm. Oh, well. Are you free? You and I haven't gone for a drink in a while. Thank you, sir. But I have another meeting to attend. I must be going. I was, I was ready to go for this meeting. And that's when this extremely fast train just came crashing in. Oh, man. I thought I was going to die. A noisy subway platform filled with people hmm. was suddenly... Not going to lie. He shouldn't have been allowed to ask her that. Did you ask for me? Is it a case? Not quite. I want your opinion on something. Sure. Your judgment is quite often correct, though. Can we discuss this over sushi, perhaps? You are making a student work late, after all. Conveyor belt only. Huh. Yes, the sort of... Four. She sh he shouldn't have been allowed to ask her that because there's an, a power imbalance between the two. He's her boss. Oh, either way, back to this. Damn, to think there'd be that much traffic. What a waste of time. I wasn't able to open the cafe today. <laughs> Just the glasses pushing up. <laughs> Whatever. Just head upstairs. There's something I need to give to you. Ooh, we're getting a present from Sojuro. Is it going to be a nanny cam or something? Talk about a gruesome accident. 80 people were involved. It's a diary. Make sure you write in it. Oh, hooray. Just what every teenager wants. A diary. You may be under probation. But there's no special limitations on what you do in particular. Besides following the law, that so in short, just be a normal person. However, I'm obligated to report on you, which is why I'm having you record your daily activities. Ah, so in short, you're gonna just pass our our diary on to on as your report, so you don't have to write anything. Yes, that's a great way to keep track of our activities. Hey, we could just lie. <laughs> I'm about to leave right now. Don't worry, I'll be there in no time. Uh huh? I'll see you soon. Well, I'm off. I'll lock the place up. So do whatever you want for the rest of the night. Oh, but don't mess up my store. If something goes missing, I'll hand you right over to the cops. Oh, when I was thinking of making a cup of coffee before bed. You got school <laughs> tomorrow. You better head off to bed, all right? I should do as I'm told for now. I should write down what happened today in my diary. Saving. You can save your game by pressing the options button. When you see the button command in the lower left, you can save it any time. I have an early day tomorrow, I should rest up. Alright, so with that, we're probably going to end the episode off here. Thanks everyone for watching. If you liked what you saw, feel free to like and subscribe to the channel. Uh, and basically subscribe to keep up to date with these videos if you want to see more. Also, I'll, I'll sort of announce this a little bit later, but I'll be sort of letting comments choose some of the choices I make along the way. 
but we'll find we'll we'll find yo, I suppose you'll all find out about that next time. I should write something. So let's just save and we'll finish up there. Alright. Bye everyone.